My talk today uh, will be on the role of endoscopic ultrasound in the evaluation of rectal cancer. Uh, there is no much literature uh, on this issue. Uh, actually, uh, here I, I am presenting to you the results of the first important study that was published in gastroenterology 10 years ago. It was in a study uh, aimed at comparing, uh, at that time, CT and US for rectal cancer staging. But I, I would like you to pay attention only on CT, since, as you all know, uh, CT uh, has been replaced by uh, MRI nowadays. So. Here you see, yeah, you see the, no, the other way, now here, thank you. Here you see the, the, the performance characteristics of uh, uh, EUS uh, on the T staging in rectal cancer. And as you see, uh, sensitivity, uh, no, I'm sorry, sensitivity, no, it's, okay, okay, thank you. That its sensitivity is about 85%, specificity 100%, and positive uh, and, and negative predictive values are, are also very high, uh, uh, and accuracy is around 90%. For end stage, uh, values are uh, not, not as good as for T stage, as happens in, in all kinds of tumors, and uh, they are around 75, 80, 89, and 90%. Uh, in this study, the, the results of US FNA were surprisingly uh, lower, uh, uh, um, but uh, this is still controversial, so we will, go, we will go on this issue later on. Now, how good is US in differentiating in, dif in differentiating body, the T stages of rectal cancer. These are the results. Yeah. Okay, thank you. These are, these are the results of a meta-analysis that was published in Annals of Surgical Oncology uh, some years ago. And as you see, uh, for the different T stages, uh, the sensitivity is, is in between 80 and 95 percent, whereas the specificity is uh, over 90 percent, and the pooled uh, diagnostic or ratio is also very high. I want you to know that for T2 uh, is a little lower. It happens always. T2 is the most difficult stage to assess, uh, uh, at least uh, for US in all kinds of cancers. Now, can EUS endoscopic ultrasonography predict early rectal cancer that can be resected endoscopically.